very often people ask me if I Googled them, okay? Or I had actually had one client once. I nailed it so well, okay, that the person, he called the person that referred me to, to him, and he said, I think the guy Googled me. She said, why do you think that? Because what he told me was so right on. Okay, what did he tell you, she asked, because she, she called me to tell me. <laughs> she said, what he told you, you're, what you couldn't find on Google. Besides, does he have your last name? Oh, I don't think so, he said. All right, listen, I, that's why I don't ask you your last name, all right, because that way you cannot accuse me of Googling you. And by the way, I don't have the time. I am so busy right now, thank God, with sessions and, and trying to get some writing done, trying to get these videos done, trying to get, I'm on TikTok, by the way, if you want to look me up, it's Bob B. Cool Medium on there, and I do one minute, th you know, rants about whatever, it could be clients, it could be whatever, it's all about this, okay? So anyway, getting back to my client, let's, I'm going to call him um, Jimmy, okay? So... When Jimmy realized that he didn't give me his last name, when Jimmy realized that a lot of stuff he, I told him you can't find on Google, he felt pretty good about his session. And he's still a client today. I talked to him frequently, not as much as I did in the beginning after he suffered his loss. But I'm still there for him. Now let me tell you something. Try to Google yourself, just for the hell of it. Unless you're somebody, even if you're somebody, you know, First off, you're not going to find things, everything on Google. Okay, what you're going to find on Google are things that people control. Let's say you're doing um, a major star, okay? Uh, Google, Google them. See, you know, see if you can find them. See what you find. Don't forget that almost everything on Google is controlled by you and what, they, what people see, okay? Especially if you're, you know, well-known. I had a client told me about her brother, who's still alive, okay, it was just a conversation, fantastic artist, gave me his name, I googled him, I couldn't find him. It took me a long time, it happened to be a day when I was slow, it took me forever to find him. And when I finally found him, okay, there was very little about him, and I didn't see much of his work, okay, so I don't have the time to google you, you're not going to find everything on there. By the way, some people think that their whole life's history is on Google. They think they're that important. So John Smith thinks he's that important. Um, and the reason why I don't ask last names is, well, I never did, but this dentist calls me one day. So I, said, this is, I asked him, how did you find me? He said, I'm not telling you. Well, I just want to know if somebody's recommended you or you got me through your webpage. See, I don't advertise anywhere. I do some social media, I do this, but I don't advertise, okay? I've got my websites, I've got my Facebook page. That's it. Well, I don't want to tell you because it might affect the se you know, our, our session. I said, well, unless you're living an identical life that this person re recommended you, I doubt it, number one. Number two, I probably won't remember who that person was that recommended me. I just wanted to know. Oh, okay, yes, yeah, somebody recommended me. Okay, fine. So I gave him all this stuff. And I gave him the fact that he and his father worked together and they came out, they worked in small places and eventually it came out that he and his father were dentists, okay? Um, so at the end, I, I said, you know, is there somebody that, that hasn't come through that you want to talk to? So he says, yes, yeah. just give me their name. He gives me their name. So I, I tell him, um, redhead, blah, blah, blah. Yes, yes, that, that's her, but I don't want to talk to her. She didn't want to come through. This guy was just being a total jerk. Okay, I said, that's not why they don't come through. Sometimes they just want to be asked for. So, no, forget it. She didn't want to talk to me. I don't want to talk to her. Okay, all right. So we, we hung up. So the guy paid me through PayPal, all right. So you know what I did. I went there, got his last name, and I Googled him. This is when I was a lot slower. This is probably in the beginning of my coming out. And you know what I would have found out? I would have found out his dentist. Nothing else that I told him would have come out. Not a word. Okay? 
So don't think you're that important. Don't think I'm going to Google you. I don't have the kind of money that a TV medium would have where I can put private investigators on, check, run your credit checks, run all this other stuff. I don't have that kind of money. I don't have that kind of time. That's cheating. I wouldn't feel comfortable with myself. If I did that, I'd hate myself. I wouldn't be able to live with myself if I took advantage of people like that. So I don't. I'm not going to Google you. Don't worry about it. When you call me, give me your first name or, or reach out to me. Give me your first name only. Tell me nothing about yourself. Let that come through organically. Let the souls bring it through. Always remain hopeful, never hopeless. Always remain optimistic, never pessimistic. And please subscribe and like my channel. I really could use it. Thank you very much. Have a great day. Thanks for stopping by.